Hi, I'm uh, Chet Justice. I'm at K-Scope 13 in New Orleans, Louisiana. I'm sitting here with Leighton Nelson, who today performed what some would call a miracle. <laughs> Leighton, can you talk about what, what, what it is you did today? Okay, well, we were doing a, planning on doing a live demo for one of my presentations, which was SQL Developer uh, for DBAs. Okay. However, uh, we noticed that Oracle Database 12C had just been released a day prior uh, to the presentation. And so everyone was a buzz and talking because everyone was anxious for the 12C to be released. And so I got the idea, hmm, why not just do a demo of Database 12C in the presentation? <laughs> so that was an awfully brave, uh, brave thing to do, you think? Either awfully brave or awfully stupid, <laughs> uh, one of the two. So whichever way I take it, I was like, I'm at least going to try. So. Right. So you, you managed to download the software over the conference Wi-Fi, <laughs> is that correct? Yes. Um, I, I probably disrupted a couple people's <laughs> <laughs> emails <laughs> and stuff because it took uh, about four hours to download those two uh, disks for the installation media. Wow. So, so you started, the, so it was released yesterday, you, your presentation was this morning, was it 11 o'clock? 11 o'clock? 11.15. 11.15. Yes. So between last, yesterday, less than 24 hours mm -hmm. that it was officially announced, you managed to, to go ahead, get the software, install it, and then what was, so you've got everything set up, what, you've got the database installed, what, what were you going to demonstrate, what was your demo about? So I had noticed that Oracle also had released uh, in their Oracle Learning Library mm -hmm. a series of by OBEs or Oracle by Examples, so which are tutorials on how to use SQL Developer with Database 12C. Right. So I got the idea, hmm, I'm doing 12C demo, 12C has been released, why not just put them both together? So I read a couple of those tutorials, mm -hmm. got an idea of how to do uh, cloning using pluggable databases and 12C, and I was able to actually pull it off uh, by some miracle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think brave is going to be the word they uh, use, and, and going by the Twitter verse, uh, everybody is quite impressed with Well, neither that, uh, some people have the acronym BOS, uh, I'll let you determine what that means, but... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to think on that one. I, I did see the BOS, but I did not try to translate it. Um, the let's see. So you used SQL Developer as well. So you were you were doing your your original demo was SQL Developer for DBAs. Now you're gonna you're still using SQL Developer with the 12. So you cloned a 12 database. Uh, correct. But, yeah. Right, but but it, cloning is not the same as it was before, where you're not doing a whole installation or a whole data, but you're doing that's pluggable databases Correct. now, right? Exactly, and that's the beauty of 12C is the multi-tenancy and pluggable databases. So prior to 12C, to clone a database, you'd either have to use a, a storage-based uh, technology to do copy and write, right. or maybe use Arman cloning features, or uh, probably database as a service using OEM. What 12C does is gives us the ability to do that using uh, very little space in a very short amount of time using their pluggable database feature. And that's all built into SQL Developer as a part of the current release uh, 3.2, I believe. Mm -hmm. uh, you have the capability right now to use it to clone pluggable databases and to unplug and plug databases. So, I mean, it, it opens up a whole new possibilities for developers and, and DBAs alike. Wow. So, how long did the actual cloning take? The cloning of the database took like a minute. Wow. Yeah. That's. Uh that says a lot, doesn't it's it? Awesome. It's awesome. It's going to make your job easier? Oh, definitely much easier from now on. So if I need to spin up test environments or dev QA environments, uh, having pluggable databases and being able to clone them uh, in a short amount of time, I mean, I've never had that before. So so we're going to get, so the developers and the DBA is going to get along a lot better. I would hope so. <laughs> we can never guarantee Unless you that. are a developer. Well, right that's, yeah, that goes without <laughs> saying. Um, so one other thing I wanted to mention that, that you recently authored a book. You co-authored a book. Yes. Um, can you talk a little bit about that? Yes. So the book is entitled uh, Expert Oracle Enterprise Manager 12C. And uh, the, the main author was Kellyn Poitvon. And a group of us came together and we worked on this book for a 
a couple of months. Uh, it was a very unique experience in trying to get this together based on people from all over the world and different experiences and backgrounds. Uh, but what it does, it gives us a very good overview and insight of how to use Oracle Enterprise Manager 12C uh, to manage databases. Awesome. Well, that's it for today. Leighton's got to catch a flight. He's yep. going back to St. Louis. Leighton, thank you very much. Thank you, Jet. Congratulations. Thanks.